this one. Just thank you. All right, no problem. No problem at all. What do you want the outcome to be today? Good morning, pretty boy Flacco. You think you're gonna mend your, uh, you ever gonna mend your relationship with Relly? Is that a goal of yours? Hey, Seb, you feel like you're being framed? Sounds like that's what the argument is. How you guys feeling about how it's going down in there? Do they comment? Breaking, breaking, the judge in the ASAP Rocky case said what? Now let's get to it. Hey everyone, welcome, welcome, welcome to The Mix as you can see what this video is going to be about. But before I continue with my commentary, reaction, and opinion, I need for everyone to like this video and share this video. Those who are tuning in to The Mix for the first time, go ahead and smash that subscription button and hit the notification bell. That way you will be in tune with all the content I drop on my channel. I need for everyone, yes, everyone, listen to this video from beginning to end. Head on over to the community section and vote, 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 vote. If you're interested in donating, go ahead and hit that thanks, uh, the super chats, all of that. And donation information is in the description section. I have Zelle, Cash App, all of that. It goes towards content enhancement creation. Now, let me jump right into the topic. Okay, everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome again. Like this video. Like, 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 like. It's free to like. Sometimes the views don't be matching the likes. The likes don't be matching the views. So just go ahead and smash that like. It's okay. Don't be scared. Okay, you guys. Today is Monday. Oh, my goodness. Oh, the week of Thanksgiving, November 20th. How are you guys doing today? I would be remiss if I did not ask. I'm hoping to possibly do a giveaway maybe um, before the month is over. Possibly, possibly. Your girl, The Mix, I've been all over the place for the past three months. And let me go ahead and jump right into the topic. It's about ASAP Rocky. Oh, my gosh. A lot of media channels, outlets, especially via internet-wise, they're not really covering this. So I'm going to go ahead and share a couple screens with you guys. But as you can see, the judge ruled in the ASAP Rocky case that he must stand trial for allegedly pow powing his friend who is a group member that is they all go by asap this or asap that it's kind of weird but i'm not like a fan of asap rocky in terms of as a music artist and all of that not to say that i don't like him but mm, i mean his music is not totally for me i can't even name any of his songs or whatever i always thought that he was pretty handsome though a cute and uh interesting way you know so but also it's being rumored that his relationship with rihanna it seems like it's becoming a bit strained that's a rumor but let me go ahead and share some excerpts from this article and to bring you guys up to speed as to how we got here okay you guys according to cbs news los angeles judge found monday that there is enough evidence for asap rocky to stand trial for allegations that he fired a pow pow at a former friend and collaborator outside a hollywood hotel in 2021 superior court judge ml veller made the ruling at a preliminary hearing after hearing roughly a day and a half of testimony rocky has pleaded not guilty to two felony counts of assault with a semi pow pow his attorney attempted to cast doubt on a case while questioning a police detective his attorney is attorney lorian <laughs> okay the article further cites your old hip-hop star born rakeem mayers is also a fashion mogul and two-time grammy nominee he is in a relationship with pop star rihanna with whom he has two young sons Villers said, and this is the judge, Villers said the totality of the video and testimony shows there is sufficient evidence for the defendant to go to trial. She emphasized that preliminary hearings have a much lower, lower evidence standard than a trial. And she was only finding probable cause. So what this means is that you, you don't have to have an attorney. The detectives, the law enforcement, the prosecutors don't have to have an overwhelming amount of evidence to present to the judge to determine if there's probable cause for the case to move forward to trial. So in this situation, in this case, in this instance in California, with this particular judge and for this case, ASAP Rocky, the judge determined 
probable cause to proceed to trial. We continue. Rocky City in the courtroom showed no visible reaction at the first day of the hearing, which resumed Monday after a long delay. Terrell Eforum testified that he and Rocky, a friend since childhood, wow, this is unfortunate, had belonged to the same collective of musicians and artists at their New York high school. So this is the guy ASAP allegedly pow powed, but friends, group members, not sure what happened, what went wrong. He said their relationship had started to go sour and resulted in the standoff in Hollywood on November 6, 2021, when he said Rocky first pulled a pow pow on him and in a later confrontation, fired shots that grazed Ephraim's um, knuckles. So he was injured due to the pow pow. Rocky's attorney, Joe, he is known in the industry, this particular attorney, Joe T. Rocky's attorney, JT, established while questioning a police detective that seven officers who searched a sidewalk and street about 20 minutes after the pow pow were allegedly fired, found no evidence of the pow pow, and that a pair of nine millimeter shell cases in police possession were recovered by Ephraim, who returned to the scene about an hour after the standoff. Mm. How did he return? The one who got pow pow, allegedly. ASAP Rocky's attorney played body camera video of the officers who searched the ground for about 10 minutes. Ephraim, who first went to police to report the incident two days later, turned all the all excuse me, turned over the shell casings, which the detective said had no recoverable fingerprints on them. Prosecutors showed a separate video from near the scene where no people are initially visible. But what sounds like two pow pows can be heard. Then a man comes running around a corner, then slows to a walk. The man's identity is not clear in the video, but Flores testified they have established it is Rocky. Mm. LAPD detective Frank Flores testified under except Rocky's attorneys questioning that no 9mm pow pow was recovered when a search warrant was served on Rocky. Where the, where the fire on Rocky? <laughs> Cue to show a still from surveillance video showing a man in a hooded sweatshirt whose face is not visible holding what appears to be a gun along with another image from the same video showing the face of the man in the sweatshirt with no pow pow visible. Flores testified that the combined images led them to establish it was Rocky. Mm. They stopped Rocky's attorney who is also representing Donald Trump in his New York criminal case and others pressed the detective on the weapon suggesting police had no way of knowing whether it was a loaded or even real pow pow that pow pow or whatever it was was not tested right except rocky um attorney said no it was never recovered flora said except rocky attorney further cites you're not sure if it's an operable pow pow or a non-operable pow pow or whatever oh he really good oh he breaking it down Without having it, I can't tell you whether it's operable, the detective replied. Mm. ASAP Rocky's attorney further cites, uh, tried to cast doubt on the minor injury to Ephraim's hand, questioning why he waited until he returned to New York to seek medical treatment. He showed the detective a photo of the scraped fingers and said sarcastically, it's a miracle he survived that pow powing. Oh, wow. So ASAP Rocky's attorney is getting very, becoming very sarcastic in the courtroom. You know what, you guys? These attorneys, they like to flex their muscles, quote unquote, you know, they, you know, mojos and all of that in the courtroom. They live for stuff like this, respectfully, and in my opinion. The judge admonished him, meaning the judge went off on, um, I'm not going to say went off, but she scolded ASAP Rocky's attorney. One of several times she told ASAP Rocky's attorney to change his tongue. Rocky was arrested at Los Angeles International Airport in the case in April and charged in August. He arrived in a courtroom Monday morning wearing a dark suit, sunglasses, and a face mask after spending the weekend at the Formula One Las Vegas Grand Prix auto race, where he had a prominent role as Puma's creative director in the clothing brand's partnership with F1. He has released little music in recent years and has become better known as the romantic partner, fellow fashion influencer, and co-parent of Rihanna. With whom, he, with whom he had a second son in May. His first two studio albums in 2013 and 2015 both went to number one on the Billboard 200. Rocky also became an unlikely cause for then President Donald Trump, who said he was trying to get the rapper freed and returned to the US when he was jailed after a brawl in Sweden in 2019.
he was found guilty of assault at trial but was given a conditional sentence that meant no additional jail time in california courts preliminary hearings like these are a sort of miniature version of a trial with only a judge deciding whether sufficient evidence ex exists to move forward oh so that's how it is with this particular case in california the standard of proof for doing so is far lower than what's required for criminal guilt you guys asap rocket is trending on x formerly known as twitter and let me check out let's check out some comments and some information on this according to this person judge rules rapper asap rocky must stand trial on felony charges he pow pow at former friend what the comments are saying surprise this was a settlement a long time ago so everyone can move on maybe because of cv the cases were a bit on pause stall that was all over the united states the kind of pandemic era so they're just getting back to the flow of things you know early part of this year and last year so i mean that's why Okay, this person said, can't they just make a deal? Let the man get on with his career. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right. I guess that's how the justice system is supposed to work, right? Why are you pow powing at people? I need my lawyer ASAP. This trial might get rocky. I went to high school with this guy. He would not do such a thing. Free Rakeem. He should face the allegations. Why is he running away? The next person said, G pow pow issues every day the next person will okay y'all gotta stop coming for rihanna's black family unit did his friend get hurt this, this other guy said yeah his friend was allegedly in injured and it was allegedly intentional rihanna should have chose me i would never pow pow at one of my friends okay everyone so what are your thoughts this particular case is not getting mass coverage i wonder why because ASAP Rocky is with a, a rock star is with a billionaire woman, <laughs> Rihanna, you know? So this is interesting. This is going to be interesting to see how all of this plays out. Some people I've noticed who have covered this in the YouTube space, some people really believe that he might go to prison for doing this. And I hear that California laws are very tough and strict when it comes to pow pow firearms. So oh wow especially if the prosecutors go hard with this and now nine, nine times out of ten when it's a celebrity these prosecutors want to flex their muscles rear uh, advancement move for them especially if the outcome goes in their favor so wow but yeah let me know your thoughts down in the comment section do you believe that rocky will be found guilty do you believe he will take a plea deal i don't know he might go ahead and take a plea deal if that's even an option if that's going to be on the table he might cop a plea cop a plea to because because he has two new babies he has two kids by rihanna i can't see him going through the full trial although uh the judge just approved that there's still opportunity especially if presented and if his lawyers his, if his team att attorneys negotiate this with the prosecutors there's still opportunity to possibly cop a plea for maybe lesser charges so but it seems like the friend that he allegedly pow pow is standing 10 toes down and don't care about being on paperwork and is showing up and raising his hand and on the oath and he is telling it all so i wonder what happened with his friend didn't really touch on that in the article to for them to have like this bad blood now this is really interesting childhood friends in the same group and then it goes this way eesh wow so yeah let me know your thoughts i'm going to go ahead and run some polls in the community section do you believe asap will cop a plea deal if it's offered this is going to be interesting to see how it plays out I, like i said i'm just shocked that the media is not like totally totally covering this especially like the internet streets from x you know you, i showed you x but it's not he's trending but it's not like trending trending you know so but a, a lot of people are not doing think pieces on it if that makes sense so but yeah, thank you guys for tuning into the mix. Like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe. And I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.